First Australia. I am 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 First Australia. So my first journey began back in 2015 when two of my children were really interested in robotics and we looked at some robotic courses and found out all about First Lego League and I guess the rest is a little bit of history but I've been coaching since then, uh, then volunteering since 2017 um, and really just continuing to enjoy everything that First can offer my children and my family. I've always loved mentoring, I've loved uh, volunteering. I was at the very first uh, regional that we had here. Uh, now I'm at this one. I've been at all of the ones between then. Yeah, I've been a technical volunteer, I've been a mentor, I've been, yeah, just about everything at some point. I started first back in I think 2018 and I started with Lego League. So throughout my time I think I've learned a lot of skills, I've made a lot of new friends and I think I've fallen in love with first. Um, but yeah, I don't know, like the journey's been very steady, there's never been a downhill. I've always enjoyed learning about robotics and STEM and getting to grow with everyone I work with. I started with the first LEGO League back in 2015 and did that for about six years before I came over to the first robotics competition to join in this wonderful mess back here. I love about the first events, the crazy hecticness you get in all of them, going around ramp rampantly fixing your robot and making friends with everyone else here to have just an amazing time. I started in 2009 as a coach, just a neighborhood team, like my two boys and a couple other friends. And from there I was asked to volunteer and it was the best question I was ever asked. And when I said yes, best decision I ever made to become a volunteer. Since then, I've been involved with FTC, FRC, FLL, from Melbourne up to many local tournaments in New South Wales. I was actually a quiet person once. I didn't have this crazy personality. First has allowed me to come and have more fun than should be legal for a person my age. So the journey's been awesome, all because of volunteering for FIRST. I'm a big fan of the group dancing. I've always enjoyed it. Um, it really gets everyone together. I know the competition is fun, and I was on drive team, so that was also a really big part of my time. But just having everyone just stop what they're doing and come together and just kind of have fun was, was a really nice aspect of the competition that I really enjoyed. What FIRST means to me is community, learning, experiences. I guess so many different skills that my kids and then my family have learned through FIRST, through being part of FIRST, that is more than just robots. It's, it's the whole package. I really love how at FIRST events, you can go up to literally any team and have a conversation and they're all so nice and they're always willing to help you with anything you need. And it's just really like, instead of being a competition, it's just like so supportive as well. I know FIRST to me is a family, I think. It's welcoming, it's been there, I think. It's important to me. It's something that's just a part of me, I think. I love the people involved in FIRST. Um, I actually met my wife through the program and something she always says is we don't build robots here, we build people. That's the exciting bit. First is a community to me. It's more than robots like you would do at your chess or your athletics club where you learn an activity and you get good at that activity. It's you learn an activity and you grow not just in activity but in your friends, the family you build around you in that community and that's what first means to me and why it's so special to me.